Hi everyone, welcome back to the my channel. My name is Anil, and in this another video tutorial, we are going to learn that how we can make a click event, and on this click event, how we can call a function. So now let's get start. So in these two files, we have to just make the code. So in the ts file, we have to just define the function. So let's define a test function, like test fun, and just write some code like alert. hello from function all right uh, please keep in mind you don't need to put here function keyword because in the class uh, base or you can say that the oops js you don't need to just write here function like this you just have to uh, make function just simply with a test fun all right and now let's make a button here and on this button just write some text like click me and here we can just make a property like uh, click and on this property let's call this function so for that we just need to write here the function name which is the function test just simply write here like this and just use it like this All right so now let's uh, just come back on a browser and let's try to click it now you can see that the function is called now let's see how we can just simply pass some parameters this is also very easy let's pass some string from here like hello and here let's take a variable and just call this function again All right so whenever I'm just going to click on it it will just respond me as an hello so this is the way that how you can just simply call a function in the angular and in a similar way you can just use here any other events like hover blur change and whatever you want to do All right so this is a similar thing so thanks for watching this video if you still have any kind of confusions you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video bye bye take care